Victory! Welcome to my channel. Can you hear me? Hey, yeah, I'm hearing you. Thank you for having, <laughs> having me. Thank you for joining me. Still looking fresh. Still looking good. So right now we're already recording. So let me let you introduce yourself. Okay. Um. Hey, I'm Victory. Of <laughs> Um. I was an athlete baller before, but I transferred to the Caribbean University. Particularly, um, International American University, St. Lucia. That's it. Okay, that's it. <laughs> so, basically, what I'm going to be doing today, I'm going to be comparing medicine and surgery in two different countries. So, he's in the Car Caribbean, mm. and I am in Nigeria. Um, right now, I'm in, Tr I'm in Trinity, because I transferred after my med four. Okay. Well, I'm in Afe Babalola University. Five point five years. Okay, okay. In Nigeria, it takes six years, six, seven, six ish, seven. Let me say it like that. For six years in total. Uh, when I explain the whole thing, like um, because there are there are two exams you have to write. Okay. So so those two exams now can even sum up to like six months plus. It depends depend on how long it takes to read for the exam. Oh. Yeah. So that's okay. So the amount of time you spend in your medical school is depending on like when you want to write the exam. Yes. Okay. Because so some people take two years, some people take a year, some people take like take three months. Like it varies, people. Okay. Okay. No problem. <laughs> Yo. Um. Well, to be honest with you, everybody has different experience with their courses. Mm. Like. Mine was pharmacology. For some reason, like it, it just seemed like a lot to cram for me, but I got through it. Okay. But some people might say that that's their easiest, so I don't know. Okay, between anatomy, biochemistry, and physiology, which one was the hardest for you? Physiology. For me, I would say biochemistry. That's it, it's pretty. Okay, was my easiest. <laughs> that was my idea, actually. But I, I think that's because I had a really good teacher for it. Um, I would say pathology is harder, but I enjoy pathology more because for some reason, like it's quick, it clicked for me faster. Like I could remember it more than from that pharmacology. Mm. I don't know why. Because pathology has a lot to like it's everything. The people, the physiology, the histology. The um, anatomy, everything is inside there. So, um, pathology is actually harder than pharmacology, but I think, but I thought it was easier to me. Yeah. I think I think pathology is harder, but pharmacology, I just it, 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 it was like my own issue pharmacology personally. Mm -hmm. I just don't know what I I will cram it and then I forget after a while. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that that was what showed me. I, mean, I haven't written my clinical subjects yet, but very soon next year. But from the rumors I've heard in Nigeria, pharmacology mm. carries the cake. Pharmacology is a whole different ball game. And then, for me, yeah, my first thing was throughout my first medical exam. Next, how was it? How was it? Yeah. Because it was my first exam, I didn't know what to expect. I didn't know how to feel. I didn't know what they would do. Uh, so I was like <laughs> anxious as well as everybody. I was like, hey, will these people go to heaven and earth to set questions? Will they bring a patient to the exam room for uh, even starts at, because our teacher then no, it's even the same teacher. The person that was teaching us, he scared us. So me too, I put everything in my head that this exam can go sideways. So I was already so anxious, I was overwhelmed, I didn't know what to expect. But at the end of the day, it was fine, everything was great. Like, what was that one, the one that had this for you? Because that's an that's international exam. Oh. You write it before, after every class, you write it. Okay, okay, okay. The, the, the medical board in the US, they send the exam, mm. send it to us, we write the exam, we pass, go to the next class. Uh, for admission. Well, um, 
it depends. Like, you know how I was not going so I transferred them. Yeah. I don't know if they can't transfer them. Okay. I, I, I transfer, just, I, I just, I transfer it to pre-med, but if you want to transfer it to your med, you need to write end cards. Okay. Or you, or, you, or, or you should have like a first degree. Okay, 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 okay. Like, yeah. In Nigeria, jam, work. Um. Hmm. Basically, the the annoying thing about writing exams every every two weeks. Uh, you get. I've heard that. Yeah. I've heard that. Well, my biggest challenge so far is the overwhelming workload. But I'm getting used to it. And the mental breakdowns. <laughs> Do I have it all? Uh, Too many. Ah. Yeah. Ah. I don't even have to study. I just use my textbooks and maybe some videos on YouTube. Mm-hmm. Like um, for pathology, I used um, what's it called? Um, sketchy. This is, sorry, for my I use sketchy. Mm-hmm. And then there are some Kaplan videos. There are some Kaplan videos that my friends. Um, sent to me that I was using use for pathology, but, but, but I didn't really um, do it that much. I just used mostly um, the first aid that they gave us that okay. I was sent by the professor. That's all. That makes sense. Well, the app I used to study, Anki, that's Anki Droid. It was only about chemistry, I was in the military. Um, they were talking about. The pH, I think. Yeah, talking about pH, and that day was pretty great for me because, like, that was, that was like my first day. I came, I just came the night before. Uh, so when I night the class, and, and I usually late, like, I, I, I really didn't reach the exam when I came. So when I entered the class, so the guy was talking about pH balances and everything, and I knew it though. But when he asked, he just asked me a question, and then I asked through that, like, um, um, the sun has answered this. Yeah, it was, it, it was kind of embarrassing, but I couldn't write that very well. You go, man. Well, the first topic for me was Almighty Upper Limbs, Lower Limbs, Anatomy, Gross Anatomy. Okay. It's just multiple choice. Just multiple choice. Okay. Yeah. What else is multiple choice, theory, practical, and then steeple chase or viva, depending on your level. Then you now have viva. Like they'll ask you the questions, defend your knowledge. To be honest with you, yes, it is. It's really stressful, yes. Like, dude, it's extremely stressful, but I don't think they don't want to do so. I'm looking towards it. I won't say hard, I, I, I won't say hard, I'll say it's a lot. Yeah, exactly. It's a lot. Yeah, I think it's just hard because what we're doing is kind of like like stuff that we should know for our life, yeah, but it just like a lot of information that's in a short period of time. Exactly, the workload that makes it hard, but eventually you just get used to it and you might as well stay in black course and the other course will have like more time to think about it. So, the rumors that circle medicine being so impossible, anybody can study it, you don't even have the engineers to study it. Uh, oh, that's what we're doing during our orientation. Like, you don't have to be the smartest person in your school or everything. You just have to show commitments. Okay, okay. Well, that's all I have for today. My current one, yes, my previous one, not really. Because I was in a scholarship throughout, almost throughout the whole time. Okay. Like, I was, playing, I was just playing half of the fees throughout. Yeah. In Nigeria, the current school I'm in, it is expensive. But I guess compared with like US medical school, it's not that bad. <laughs> sometimes yes, yeah, sometimes no. That's the way. Yeah. Initially, I was too busy to notice. Like, I just thought it the normal medical life. But when I entered 200 levels, as I said, I cannot live life like this. I have to have extra curriculars. I have to do something <laughs> outside. Just Uh-oh. So, so, so right now, I'll see you. I'm enjoying it. Mm, my social life is dead, to be honest. Like, <laughs> it, like okay, what my class normally do, we um, 
after each exam, we write this mini exam every two weeks. So after each exam, we just go to this um this bar slash restaurant near my place, which is we just go there. It takes some drinks and we eat. It's those moments that are worth it. Well, there are times that we just go off to the um, the resort part of the island and just chill sometimes. Exactly. So but that's that's, that's only happened like, like a couple of times. Not really that much. There are moments you have to cherish. Sorry. You cherish it. Yeah. Those are the times. Oh my God, it's happening right now. Don't even try to deny them. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, after your med, for you have to just go and start reading for your step, your step exam. Okay. okay. That's yeah. yeah. So, so I, I'm done. I'm actually done with the island right now. I'm going to be in the US, so I don't have my visa yet because of the corona stuff that's happening. Mm-hmm. I need to get my visa so far. That can be. But then the other person they left. Okay. Yeah. Um. No. Yeah. We don't get. You know. I, I, I think, think the only the only time, time that, you, that you actually get paid is that when 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 you graduate and you do your residence, they pay you they pay you your residence. Okay, so this was a funny question I came across Google. The distress. <laughs> distress. <laughs> Me. I don't I don't really smoke, but I drink. <laughs> Well, well, maybe, maybe the work, work, um, they can't deal with the work. Because I know that I've, I've had some classmates that dropped out. Yeah. Like, like I, um, when, when I started my med one, um, there were, um, two guys that were there. The, the first guy left after the first day, but I think that was due to, like, financial issues. Then the other guy stayed and left after the first exam. Um... Okay, okay. normally no, after my classes, my classes is normally end by 3, sometimes 4, sometimes 5. The classes I end by 5, I study, I start studying around, um, around 7. Like, like I, I go home at 8, I run to 7 to like 11, then I go to bed. But well, my classes I end by 3, because, um, the, my classes end by 5 when I was in Meg 2, but after Meg 2, I end by 3. So, um, um, when I end by 3, I, I I come, come home, home, I chill a bit, then around six 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 thirty, I start studying to like eleven or so. Okay. For me, minimum mm. of three hours, maximum five six hours. Then when it's exam period, that's when we can be knocking eight hours, nine hours. Nah, it is. <laughs> Nah, cause since I'm putting on the work in all the previous days, exam period, like, like, I did that, like, like weekend time, time just to, like, just to revise and put the questions out, I'll be able to put it in. Okay. I had this video, but, uh, okay. Um, even, even without reading, reading I can, I can sleep, sleep around, like, 1 a.m., 2 a.m., I wake up by 7, 6, 7, 8, the morning. Okay. Let me see. Mm-hmm. But the days I don't read so much can be eight hours because I would want to sleep. I would sleep. Nah. I can't <laughs> do it. I, I, I left after for a reason. I can't, I can't do it. That's <laughs> Would I yeah. switch? I would because I love traveling. I love new experiences. So I would like to see where it comes to somewhere else. So... Like maybe a one year exchange program, shot. One year, go there, experience it. Uh, oh, <laughs> um, because most of your information are, like, sorry, most of your, um, of your tools are online. Like, I'll test some, some, I'll test books online. Yeah. I'll, I'll notes online. Like, like, when I first came, I hated taking, taking my laptop to school because it was big and my bag wasn't that big. big. So, so I would not be coming in with it. Uh, so, so I'll just go on my phone. Wait, well, but that, but that was during my pre med. When I entered med, med, my <laughs> teacher was like, if you could be in for classes, you need to be using your laptop or your iPad. I was like, okay. So I started bringing my iPad, my laptop to school. Because the teacher will project slide on the screen. Um, we will, we will not be looking at it, but 
Change clothes, clothes yeah. you do. He has yeah, to normally fast, fast and they don't always make preferences. Like, like they also write on the board. Like, like they have some additional information. Like, 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 I remember I had this teacher, almost Mr. Moiti. He taught me an anatomy and neuroscience. This guy, this guy, this guy, come to class. He will not look at his slides. Like, then no, 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 then Go to the border and write, write down, down some things, draw some diagrams. And that, that man, honestly, honestly if, if you don't do what he says in the class, class you have to do the exam. exam. Period. You, you have to fail. Like, like, there's no way you can really slide or anything. You must. So, if you don't do that man in class, you have to do the exam. And you can always waste your time carrying so many textbooks. At the point, you just say, bro, I'm moving digital. Not really that hard. Just, just apply, apply, do the interview, interview write, write your, your um, write your personal statements, statements give, them your, give them your give them your 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 your, 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 your results from your current from your current school. This is that's easy to get out of the Caribbean school. Okay, so if you want to go to the Caribbean, take notes from him now. It's not hard. In Nigeria, it's not really hard competition, but even there are plenty of medical schools that apply. So just look out for the right one. It also, also varies on, 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 the, on, on the on what you want to specialize in. Okay. Yeah, because yeah, your residency, some people do um, five years, years, some do two, some do three. Because uh, what, what I want, I want to, to do, uh, what I want to specialize in, can take like five years, five, 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 six years after. Yeah. Some so people take three years. Like, like, I think family medicine takes three, three years or so residency. Then general surgery takes five years of of residency. Like it just varies. But, but you can, can be, be an actual, but, but, but you, you can, can um, after, after your, your after your, after, after you graduate, you write steps right too. So after you write steps too, you can just maybe decide to be a beginner professional and just write steps too and get your license. So yeah. in Nigeria, I think at the same time, it just depends on which you get to which which um, what specialty you want to go into. So thank you so much, Victory, for coming on my YouTube channel. Please tell them to subscribe. No problem. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video to the very end. Thank you. This is my first time doing this segment that is comparing medicine. More of this to come. So please leave a comment, like, and subscribe. Become a warrior today. Have a wonderful day, everyone. Goodbye.